you can delete dimensional constraint variables, and there are several methods you can use. In the Parameters Manager palette, select a row and click the Delete button. Or, you can select the row and press the Delete key on the keyboard. Or, you can select the row, right-click, and choose Delete from the shortcut menu. Note that you can also use the control key to select multiple rows to delete. When you delete a constraint variable, the associated dimensional constraint in the drawing is also removed. If the variable you removed was referenced by other variables, AutoCAD asks you what to do. If you convert the dimensional constraint to a user parameter, a user parameter with the same name will be created and that user variable will be used in any expressions that included the variable that you deleted. If you delete the parameter name, the name is deleted from all expressions. The remaining variables retain the value calculated by the expression as a constant. This ensures that the geometry does not change. You can also select a dimensional constraint in the drawing and delete it as you would any other AutoCAD object. Doing so also deletes the parameter. If you do this, AutoCAD displays a warning to tell you that one or more dimensional constraint or user variables had expressions that contained the parameter you just deleted. Again, the parameter you deleted is replaced with a numerical value in those remaining expressions so that the geometry does not change.